out today. I did. Kind of freaking out about how beautiful like that tree is up there. Oh, so gorgeous. I love the red colors. Today I thought I would do something a little different and that is talk about how to find beauty where you live and how to like really try to incorporate that and appropriate that for your life because I don't know about you but I could use more beauty in my life all the time. Welcome back. Today's a little bit of a different video. I just wanted to come downtown Knoxville, get out and about, out of the house, and talk to you guys a little bit about how to bring more beauty into your daily life. I don't know about you, but with the way that things have been going in the world, I have definitely put myself into hiding for a while, and it wasn't until a couple of weeks ago when I went out with uh, my mom and my stepdad and my husband around the downtown area of where I live that I just kind of felt like this creative energy come back out of me and I felt oh my gosh this is kind of what's been missing and so I wanted to talk to you today a little bit about how a little bit about how you can bring Paris to where you are trying to find all the beautiful things about Paris in the city where you live because not all of us are as blessed as Parisians to live in Paris and so these are my best ways that I know of to bring more beauty, creativity, um, self-care, inspiration, Paris vibes into your life. So one of the things that I really feel is the best thing that you can do to find Paris where you are is kind of an obvious tip, but it's my first tip, and that is to try to find places in your city that are really involved in French culture, whether that's the Alliance Francaise, which Française, or whatever, it, you know, there's a location in Nashville, I think there's a chapter in Knoxville, but maybe you can find local businesses that are French inspired or even just European based, so you can get that feel of like being in another place. And kind of along that tip is to go to parts of your city where there's lots of older architecture that really inspires you. I find for me like just getting out and about and looking at all the different buildings in Knoxville and all the old architecture really 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 encourages my heart and it lifts me up and it inspires me to dress up to get out of my comfort zone to look at things in a new light and to try to just look again just like look again and see things in a different way maybe in a different way that you've never seen them before uh, the second thing that I or the third thing that I really love to do to inspire myself and to lift my spirits up and to try to find like Parisian beauty is to really dress up like I was just saying coming downtown and looking at the architecture always makes me like want to put my best foot forward and one of the ways that I do that is by layering up my jewelry and keeping things super simple and sweet. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but in the last several videos, I've been wearing these incredible gold and pearl hoop earrings from Ana Luisa. And today, our sponsor for the video is Ana Luisa. So right now, Ana Luisa is running a huge sale to promote Black Friday. And as you guys know, I've been working with them for almost three years now, I want to say, a little over two years, something around that area. They're an incredible ethical and sustainable jewelry company with all of their pieces starting at $39. And they've got gift sets now on their website. All of their pieces are made with recycled silver and gold. And these are incredible, incredible, lovely pieces that really do bring a lot of like inspiration to my life and I wear them daily. I do end up feeling much more inspired and of course I love wearing my wedding rings which I'm obsessed with. And then this is another Ana Luisa piece that I wear all the time from a previous collaboration, a crisscross ring, and then a thrifted silver ring that I love so much. And so 
I, I know that that's kind of a lot, but Ana Luisa is a really fantastic company and I know like Black Friday sales can sometimes feel super overwhelming, but honestly, this is a really great time to get something for a loved one in your life. I highly recommend getting something for your sister, yourself, your mom, your best friend, your girlfriend. Right now, Ana Luisa is actually having a humongous sale for Black Friday and so you can get 20% off of everything in their store and I would not not pass that up if I were you. <laughs> Big thanks to Ana Luisa and let's get on with the fourth tip. So the fourth way that I try to bring Paris to my life is by watching movies that really inspire me. Like I love Midnight in Paris, obviously that's a classic. Amelie, The Triplets of Belleville, anything that really is like French New Wave or that's been kind of set in Paris. Even if there's like a tiny little bit of Paris in it or French culture in it, I'm going to try to watch that movie movie and kind of study it and just soak it in. I've also been really trying to, um, moving on to like the, the fifth tip is I've been really trying to incorporate more outside time into my life. I think when you go to Paris, you see people out and about all the time. They're walking everywhere. They're going to different parks. And one of the things that I want to do more, you know, leading into the new year is spend more time exploring nature and just being outside. Like right now, I just wanted to come outside and shoot this video because it seemed like it would be more, I don't know, encouraging and uplifting and inspiring. As I say, I just think looking at things in a new light is one of the best things that you can do to find inspiration and bring in that, that Parisian vibe into your life and just kind of adopt that pace of living or that mentality of living in France or living in Paris is to just savor life a little bit, you know, like savor the small things. Another thing that I'm really excited to start doing is to bring more Paris into my life is to decorate my home for Christmas in a way that's like very French. I'm going to do some research and find out like what are some French Christmas traditions that I can incorporate into my life. My husband, you know, grew up in France and he spent a lot of his childhood there, so I think it would be really fun to try to bring some French living into life, into your way of living. And definitely through decor, like decor and decorations, I definitely want to make my dwelling spaces like personal and chic as I possibly can because you know, like when you look around at everything in your life, I do believe, and I know that not everyone feels this way, but I do believe that everything in your life should be something that's really meaningful to you, even if it's as simple as like buying a really beautiful like alarm clock or buying uh, maybe like a a heater like a space heater what if you could find the most beautiful space heater or a set of pots or like napkins or a vase or something like that like trying to curate your life without it being you know so much pressure to be perfect but definitely trying to be true to yourself and true to an aesthetic I think that that's a really beautiful way of being is there anything you want to add any way to bring Paris into your life? Any final thoughts on how to bring Paris into your life? Go to the bakery store in the morning. <gasps> oh, I love that. Okay. To get a croissant and then a coffee beverage. Hot. Can't be cold. A hot, hot coffee beverage. A hot coffee beverage. Mm. With a croissant. And walk around. And walk around. I love that flaneur. Okay, so straight from the horse's mouth, the final tip that I have for you to bring Paris into your life is to get a hot coffee beverage of some sort, a croissant or baguette or crepe, and to go and walk around and enjoy the city where you are. And I know that not everybody has you know, like the perfect city that they live in, but I guarantee you that if you look for it, if you just try to focus on what is beautiful around you, you're gonna see more beautiful things. So, you guys, before I wrap up this video, I just wanna again remind you that you can get some beautiful, inspiring 
jewelry pieces for your life and for other people in your life by clicking the link in the description box below and checking out Anna Luisa's 20% off sale. It's such an amazing deal and it's a really great way to start building your ethical and sustainable jewelry collection or to give something to someone this holiday season. Okay you guys, that is all I have for you today. I would love to know in the comment section below if you've been to Paris or not been to Paris what are some ways that you would like to bring more beauty into your life because I hope that this Christmas season, this holiday season, you'll be trying to find ways to be more inspired and to just live a more beautiful life. Yes, let me know, let me know, let me know what you think. Now, Mike and I are going to go continue to Flandreau around Knoxville as it gets to be dusk and our magic hour is leaving us. And I think he has to pee. And I think we have to eat. Okay. Au revoir. A bientôt. A bientôt, salut. salut. <laughs>